it can be really rough on a guy to be looking through a car magazine at all the fancy new sports cars and concept cars and then have to go back to his old van. But I have a solution for that. It's all about how your vehicle looks, not how it performs. All that extra horsepower and fancy suspension of a high-priced sports car are just wasted in today's traffic, aren't they? Eh? So instead of spending money you don't have on features you won't use, why not just repaint your van and make it look sportier? <laughs> now, I'm not just talking about a fresh paint job. Oh, no, I'm way past that. You ever seen those rooms where they paint the fake windows on the walls? It's called uh, Trompe Loyal. Yeah, it's French. It means trip the eye. Well, we're going to do a Trompe Loyal 10W30. So what you want to do is uh, pick out a concept car out of your magazine. Then you want to draw the shape of that on your van. I would say get something from France or Sweden or somewhere far away so they can't sue you. <laughs> now, it doesn't matter if you don't get both sides exactly the same on it. Nobody's going to ever see both sides of your vehicle at the same time, unless you have a really bad accident. Okay, now everything inside these lines, that's your fancy new sports car. Everything outside the line, you want that to kind of fade into the background, eh? So we gotta paint that to look like trees or sky or whatever. And we're gonna make it kind of blurry so that it looks like we're going 100 miles an hour. <laughs> okay, once I got my blurry background done, now I gotta fill in the shape of the sports car itself. And with that, you can, you can do that with paint, I guess, or plaster or tar. I decided to go with the handyman secret weapon, duct tape. It's easy to apply and helps hold the van together. And if you take an old potato chip bag and turn them inside out, it looks just like chrome and will never rust. And that's how you turn your ugly old van into a beautiful, sleek European sports car.